Welcome in my video tutorial. I present how to the phone G510 in network Vodafone in Ireland. Okay, we start. Um, so what we must know? I wrote the version 171 B171. The model number is here G510. 0100 and the boot number is B171 that's the original version for Ireland and for UK is the same I think so so we can do that we don't need the uh, unlocked bootloader it's very easy so you can try if you want the first time what you can do it in my folder Huawei room you found the two folder rootx and dload dload you must download on SD card to main folder so you not do it no folder do it only dload must be like first folder um, second what you can do it in settings we must do it like off fast boot here and that's it okay and now we turn on phone power off and now you press volume minus and plus together and you still hold and press the switch on and now is update that's the five second that's it now here we started again Okay, we start. Now it's nothing change. You don't see nothing, you know. But now we must connect. Connect uh, your way to cable to PC. And now what is important you must go again to settings um, now go back and developer option USB debugging must be tick that's the very important if developer yeah it's that only that So you can get that. Um, do not do it, nothing. Just open the rootix. Open main folder and main. Yeah, you click on the folder rootix and open the file rootix start. We click that. You see that, and only click the space bar, or enter or whatever key you want. The computer do it root on your Huawei. Press any key to continue. Okay. Again. 
again. You must wait a little time. Again. And that's it. The hue restart again. And now the phone is rooted. And that's it. See under it is operating. <laughs> and now you found the program super user. That's the very important program to to root. It's here. Super user. The binary, subbinary, I uh, don't see that. Uh, the subbinary is rooted, so now you can delete all files. What you don't need that. You can put all files what you install on the phone. You can put to the SD card or extension drive partition for Linux on SD card. That's it. Thank you.